welcome back to the channel. My name is Cupquake, and we are continuing the Wolf Among Us starting chapter four Hi. in Wolf's Clothing. Sure. Hello. Hi, Nerissa. Uh, Nerissa. She has something to talk to us about. Uh, last where we left off. I wonder what it is. Have what does seat. she know? What does she know? I'm having a tough day today. I, um, are you okay? Yeah. You didn't look good last Don't night. Don't worry about me, I've been better. I wasn't sure you'd be. Don't worry about me. Go around. I'm fine. Don't worry about me. <coughs> huff and puff. Still have to figure out who smokes huff those. Huff Not many people smoke those. What did Crane want with you? Let's hear it. So what brings you here? Thanks. So what is it you wanted to talk to me about? I know what you did for me, sending me to the open arms. I think you want to help me again. Yes. There's not a lot that I can talk about. You know that. So that spell Crane was trying to break. It's not just while you're at work. Huh. Forever. What I mean is... I don't want to waste your time, but I don't want you wasting your own time either. Okay. Back in the dressing room, at the pudding and pie, I told you what I was looking for, and you found a way to tell me. You sent me to the open arms. Maybe that'll work again? You can try. I just... Okay, well, what did... Okay. Go ahead. Um, is it about it... Cricket Mad? Might was work. Crane set up? Is this about the Crooked Man? You're here because the Crooked Man just sent Crane to the bottom of my list of worries. You have something you want to say about that, right? Hmm? These lips are sealed. If I could answer you just like that, I wouldn't have had to make that appointment with you. No, I guess not. Then what does she want? <laughs> Sometimes, we have to find our way through life on our own. Grasping and fumbling in the dark. I... I used to have friends to help me find my way. But now... They're gone. And I don't know what to do. Oh, Is this about space and Lily? You can trust me. Where is this going? Hmm. Is this making any sense? Is this about... I'm not sure how I can... You can trust me. Are you saying you need a friend right now? You can trust me. What I'm saying is friends matter. And I... Oh. I don't have any left. So I hope you're looking after yours. Okay. I look out for everyone. Should I suspect my friends? Look around you. Are my friends in danger? What are you talking about? Are my friends in danger? I'm sorry. I thought I could do this. What? I need you to know. I want to help, but... but... Take your time. Your lips are sealed. Take your time. It's okay. Take your time. I'm... Sorry if I'm wasting your time. I thought I knew how to say it. Ribbons. Ribbons? Faith War one too, huh? Do you like it? Hmm? It's a tool of control. Mm. Mm, it's a tool of control. How can I? It's a tool to keep you stuck in that life. Subservient. That's why you can't tell me anything. Should I remember that? It's the ribbon, isn't it? Is it the ribbon? I think it is. All the girls wear it. What? Uh, can't we just take the ribbon off? Any way to break the spell? Any way to break the that spell? spell Crane talked about. Is there any way to break it? Is there something I can do about it? No! Lips are sealed! 
What? You can't. Just stay back. I can't take it off. You can't do that. Slow down. It's all right. I'm not gonna do anything. Is she gonna die if I take that off of her? Please. Don't. All right. I didn't mean to do that. Okay. I get it. So it's the ribbon. So the ribbons. If you take them off. Comfort her. Let's comfort her. Let's comfort her. She'll remember that. If anyone finds out I came here. Okay. That's probably snow. Let's see. Listen, Sheriff. Can you keep this conversation? Of course. Us? I could be in a lot of sure thing. Trouble. Sure thing. I won't tell anyone. Don't worry. Thank you. She changed. Sorry, She's wearing I black just now. Just need to talk to the sheriff for a moment. Please excuse us. One minute. I might have a new lead for you, but I don't know how solid it is. Beauty and Beast called the office just now. They said they wanted to talk to you about something. Great. I wonder if they've heard about Crane. Now a lot Thank of people want to talk to me about different things. You should go on to your next business. I don't think you'll be wasting your time. No, wait, you don't have to go. That was... abrupt. Yeah. One way to send a message. What did she tell you? I didn't mean to rush her out. Show me an F. I took care did of it. Did you get anything from her? I don't know. I didn't say anything. <laughs> I didn't say anything. Okay, then. Good work. So, about Beauty and Beast. Do you think there's something to it? Is this the right place to look? What could they know about the um, Or do you think they just heard about last night? Did he got a loan from him? They called for a reason. What's been going on? Well, whatever it is, I'm sure they called for a reason. Suppose I better go check it out. Yeah. See what they have to say. Hmm. You know, Beauty came to me a while back. She was looking for financial assistance. Oh. I told her there was nothing I could do, and. And she said that meant she'd have to go somewhere else. Yeah. She Bigby, went to the Crooked Man. You don't think she meant that she was going to go to the Crooked Man, do you? Yeah. That would explain why they called. We need to solve this before something else happens. Who knows what? I have other matters to attend to. Other matters? Like what? Fishy. Achievement! Once upon a time. Beauty and Beast's apartment. And you didn't want to tell me what you were into With either. good reason. Look what happened. So that's back on me. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and knock. You said it was Oh. What up, Beast? What do you want? What do you mean? Freaking well, called. You, you called? Going around knocking on doors? You called? You called, right? Or, uh, was it beauty? Why would I call you? Why is he mad at me? Listen, I didn't, I didn't cheat on him. Night. Or I didn't I cheat on him. You're the only one. Whatever. And I really don't want to deal with the runaround. Snow said you called and wanted to talk to me. Well, I didn't call. Must have been beauty. She's been surprising yeah. me a lot lately. Can I? So have you. Bigby. Yet, with all the sneaking around and secrets, somehow I'm still the bad guy in this. I've had to hear about it all night long from her. Okay. Who is it? Who's Invite there? me in. Can I talk to Beauty? If you don't want to talk, can you just get Beauty for me? I don't know. Is it safe to turn my back? What the heck? I didn't... I didn't have an affair with your wife. Chill out, man. It was a murder scene. It's your pal. Bigby. Hi, Bigby. Please excuse us for just a minute. Can I talk to you in private? Yes, let's. All 
All right, time to snoop around the house. Yay! Ooh, look at that! Look at that picture! How cute! They really do have the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Do they? Look, look, look! The painting. Hmm. Talk about living in the past. Not after the way he went behind my back. Went behind his back. Call him again. What is this? Of course you do. He was keeping secrets for you. It was one. Why would I do that? Is it hollow? Can I? Is it a secret door? Let's see what is this urn? We can handle this on our own. You didn't have to bring it here. We're out of money. Why am I just knocking things like that? That's why I call. All right. Uh. Let's look at this chandelier. What the electric bill is for that thing. This is a tiny apartment. Sorry, it's been a long night. Yeah, you know what they say. What do they say? Centuries of marriage come with centuries of baggage. Is that what they I say? say? Your place? It looks uh expensive. What do you mean by that? Beast. No, really, I want to nice, know. that's all. What Aren't you, you in debt? Say, huh? Did you come why did you call? Aren't you... Wait, you why did you call? A long time, and you've never called me over. So what's this about? Is this something about that loan you took out? From the crooked man? I didn't know what else to do, so... We should deal with this on our own. Bigby's just going to complicate hey, things. I called him here, and I want to see if he can help us out. Why are you being I want to help you. Don't waste my time. What kind of trouble are you in? I want to help you. I'd like to help you, but I can't do anything if you don't tell me what's going on. I got to know one thing first. What? What if we did have something to say about the crooked man? What if we talk and you don't get it? And all this comes back on us. We'd be risking a lot. We've seen what happened. If you're honest, I'll protect you. Other people are in danger too. You might be if next. If you can't give us certain assurances, mm. we're just looking for a little peace of mind in this. Other people are in danger the only too. Ones in danger. If you have info on that crooked bastard, I need to hear it. Otherwise, I've got better things to do. Well, that was no. Please don't. Then tell me what the fuck that's is going mean. on. You're in so much debt. Look around you. This isn't the way people short on cash live. Look, we're used to a certain kind of lifestyle, okay? We couldn't just give that we up. We never meant for it to get like this. It's just that we had nowhere else to turn, and we got in over our heads. There's not a lot of work out there. Who would we be if we just lived like... Who is that? The crooked man asking for his money back. Hi there, you've reached Beauty. And Beast. Hmm? We're out doing something fabulous. Um, let me just, uh... A day at the beach? Skiing the slopes? Stop, Beast. Hey, <laughs> and we I'm can't come here. to the phone right should... now, so leave a message at the beep and we'll get back We're gonna to hear this message. <laughs> Humanly possible. That is a... <laughs> terrible... <laughs> voice. That's fucking Whose voice is that? It's time to start thinking about how else you can settle this. Because next time... You are I'll in trouble. What the hell did you get yourselves into? The crooked man's gonna get his. One way or another. Uh-oh. All I care about is, how can I find the crooked man? Who do I talk to? Where do I go? Oh, Huggies. The Lucky Pawn. That's where I borrowed the money. The Crooked Man's behind that place. I'd overheard people talking to Jersey about loans before. So, when I needed money, that's Jersey? where I went. I didn't know what to do. Have you seen you the Crooked Man? Me. You had enough on your plate. Did you ever see the Crooked Man there? When you got your loan? Or just shopping? No, never. But come on, it's his place. And the Jersey Devil never lets you forget it. I can see now that it was a mistake, but 
I'm not the only one who goes there, you know. Okay. I saw the woodsman's axe there just the other day. It was in a display case. What? I guess he's hit hard. Mary got the axe too. from there. There's a lot of that going around. I can't imagine he has a lot of Mary got the axe skills. from there. Fucking bloody Mary must go through there. She had Woody's axe last night. You yep. tried to chop my damn head off with it. Maybe if you go there, you can sort some things out. I guess I'll go check out the lucky pawn. If I can't track down the crooked man there, maybe I can make enough noise that the crooked man will come find me. Last on, time you found me. Sounds like you're just going to get beauty in trouble. And and what? You know that butcher shop, the cut above? It's the place on Tubman Street. Same block as the baker and the candlestick maker. Well, I've been delivering packages from there for a while. What kind of packages? Is, it's for the crooked man. And I don't think it's meat in the packages. Uh, you gotta understand, I need it. What work. are you delivering? You have to believe us. Well, what are you delivering? What's going on there? How does this fit into the crooked man's operation? I couldn't tell you, but I do know this. It's the only meat market in town that doesn't carry filet. I'm not sure how much actual butchery goes on there. Okay. How did you get involved with this? Johan the butcher called. He had a problem with the refrigeration unit one night. But when I finished, it was your pal Mary who showed up to pay me. Ooh. She said I was reliable. She liked that. It's the only thing I've been able to pick you up. You do their dirty it's work? Still not Is she always there? I don't want Judy to have to work, especially not where she was. Uh, it's up to me. You do their dirty care. work? So you do their dirty work. You look the other way. Work is work. All Beast. I do is deliver stuff. I just wanted to provide for beauty. Give her the kind of life she deserves. We shouldn't have to live like this. Scraping to get by. None of us should. We were royalty once. We were accustomed to a certain lifestyle. All we want is to make this place feel a little bit like home. But you wouldn't fancy understand, things. Baby. Probably not. I don't need to. I don't need to understand. It's not my fucking job to understand. My job is to keep Fable Town safe. So, where are you going? I don't know. If this all goes sideways, I'd like to know where it's coming from. I have no idea where to go. I'm gonna have to make a decision. All right, so let's see. The guy owns the Lucky Pawn, and the butcher shop is where, oh, I don't know. <laughs> let's go to the... Butcher shop. I want to know what the crooked man is hiding at that butcher. Yeah, because then it won't be so like in you your know, face. Baby, once you show up there, word is gonna spread. There may be nothing left for you to see if you go to the lucky pawn after. That's true. Well, I guess I'll find out. Wait, I don't know what you're planning to do when you find the crooked man, but is there any way you could help you out? Help us out. With what, your debt? What do you mean? Well, maybe you can make this all just go away. He wants me to kill him! Really appreciate it. What do you say? You want me to kill him? Can you help us out? You want me to kill him? You want me to kill him, aren't you? Is that what you think I do? Uh, no, of course not. I don't know how you'd get that idea. <laughs> we just, we know that the crooked Liar. man is dangerous. To all of Fable Town. I'm gonna do my job. Lucky for you, that might just solve your problems anyway. Oh, thank you, Big B. I'm sure you'll do the right thing. Thanks. They wanted me to kill him. Achievement unlocked. There was a wolf. The cut above butcher shop. No smoking. Let's keep smoking. You guys were telling me you want me to be a little more meaner when I play this. I think I am a little nice as a sheriff. That's why I can never be a sheriff. Uh, let's go ahead and look at cold drinks. 
Not very many drinks in there. Let's look at frozen meat. They don't have filet. Not very appetizing. Frozen solid. Who'd want to eat this? Um, okay. I'm not gonna ring the doorbell. We are gonna, we're just gonna go. We're gonna go. Hey. Bigby Wolf? Hey, what's going on? Well, welcome, Sheriff. Uh, what can I get for you? You interested in a particular cut? <clears throat> um, let's see. What do we have in stock? Let's, uh, let's see what we got here. All right. Flank steak on special. New York strip. Oh, I can have some wild boar in tomorrow. Where's bloody beast delivers from here? Sirloin, What's going on here? Ribs, roast, tongue. What's going on here? Got some tongue here. Johan, I want to know exactly what's going on here. We sell me lies. Did you want to buy something? <laughs> what you see is what you get. Just meat. You don't find anything else. We just, uh, we do more wholesale and meat packing than walk up service. I'd like to help. Mind you. if I look around? Really, I would. But there's uh, nothing here. Mind if I look oh, around? You don't mind if I take a look around? I guess not. I. Sheriff, I. Did you hear that? What? Oh! Oh, I'm real sorry. Hold on. I, I just gotta go check on that. He pushed the button. Don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. Butcher? I just have to go see. He pushed the button! He pushed the alarm button. Go! We're going Shit. after him. I got it covered back here, Sheriff. I'll be right out. Liar. Ooh, meat. Just wait out front. I'm coming to help you. I, I've got a bit of a mess back. I'm not going to say anything. Look, can, can you come back tomorrow, maybe? I'm sorry, Sheriff, but you're not supposed to be back here for uh, safety purposes. Where did he go? You're acting suspicious. What's going on back there? What's going on back there? I'm just doing my job, Johan. What the fuck are you doing? Oh, what? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. They're gonna kill me. Oh, God, she is gonna fucking kill me. <laughs> what the hell is he doing? He's gonna get me killed. Hiding something? <sighs> Hiding Things something? I do. What are you hiding behind that door? Huh? Please, please, Bigby. Please don't. Bigby? What happened to Sheriff? Please don't kill me, Sheriff. I'm gonna kill I you. Don't die. Please, please don't kill me. Talk or else. Please don't kill me. Talk or else. You talk, I might have I'm gonna to be mean. Do just that. Is that what I'm gonna be want, mean Johan? to you. No, no, please. You don't have to do that. I'm dead. Either way, they said to me. Johan, you could keep your life and lose your shop or lose both. What would you do? I'll deal with what's behind the door. They? In the moment. Why sneak Easy, out? Even when they got you mean Mary? They? You mean Mary? Bloody Mary? This isn't my shop anymore. That crew took it from me a long time ago. Okay. Crew, fuck. Who's the crew? The crooked man's people. Okay. Jersey Devil, D and Dumb, and that mental case, Bloody Mary. You want to talk about the real butcher? It's her, not me. This is her place. I'm telling you, they muscled in. Let's let him talk. Took over my storage and delivery a long Let's time. Let's let him ago. talk. All cause of that heat wave. That summer was even hotter than this one. Oh, I'd let Mary and those porkers stay cool in the meat locker one day, playing cards, having a great time. I guess they were sizing the place up. Shows what I get for being nice. Mm -hmm. I'm just a victim in this. 
I don't know what they do back there. Victim, we'll see. And I don't we'll see. Well, we're about to see what's back there. <laughs> what is and back then there? We'll see if I believe you. I knew this would happen. Didn't know when. Let's go ahead and there listen. There would be the day. Shh. Do I hear anything? All right, time to open it. Let's see. Use them legs, Big B. W. Ooh, is this some witch stuff? We're saving. All right, guys. Well, we gotta look inside the room. I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode right here. Another cliffhanger. We just gotta save, so uh, I think it's a good place to save and end the episode. I have no idea what's back there. It looks like some chemistry projects and whatnot. Maybe some witch stuff going on. Um, but now we know that D and Dom work for the Cricket. Well, we knew that already. We knew that already. But, like, it's for sure they are working for him, just like Mary and this other person who we haven't met. I probably should have killed D or Dumb, whoever I could have killed when I had the chance. Just one less person, one less minion to work with. You guys asked for me to play a little more aggressively. Uh, I am a little nice. Uh, I'm a nice sheriff. Um, I think the big bad, it's time for the big bad wolf to come out and be the big bad wolf. So maybe uh, we'll be a little more uh, tougher on our decisions in the next episode. But thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Come Quick, and I will see you guys later. Bye.